Trains to Birmingham are delayed by 24% of their duration, and there is an additional wait of 25 minutes before the train leaves for Derby. £10 is refunded for every full 15 minutes the train was delayed. What is the refund as a percentage of standard ticket costs on the usual fastest train from Bath to York? First, let's identify the fastest train from Bath to York. So, these three trains go from Bath to York, and the fastest one here is the 735. The way we find that is by taking the arrival time in York, subtracting the departure time in Bath. The duration of that train is 4 hours 22 minutes. Now let's calculate the total duration of delays. To Birmingham from Bath is 7.35 to 9 o'clock. Let's find the duration of that. That's 9 o'clock, subtract 7.35, which is 1 hour 25 minutes which is equivalent to 85 minutes. We know that these are delayed by 24% of their duration, so we want to find 24% of that, which is 0 0.24, multiplied by 85 minutes, which is a 20.4 minute delay. From there, there's an additional wait of 25 minutes before the train leaves for Derby, so we can add that on too. That gives us a total de delay of 45.4 minutes. We're told that for every full 15 minutes the train was delayed, £10 is refunded. Three lots of 15 minutes are 45 minutes. And obviously there's not going to be another full 15 minutes. So that means we're going to have a refund of £30 for those three lots of five minutes. So that's our refund. We want that as a percentage of the standard ticket costs for that train. And if we look on that train here, that the standard ticket cost is £131.70. So 30 divided by £131.70 multiplied by 100 is 22.8%.